All right, welcome back to the channel and welcome to Firebox Breaks. Ladies and gentlemen, we are about to do another episode of Mashup Monday. And for this one, we've got some favorites and some pretty cool cards from years past. And we are still on the chase for some big rookie cards. Hopefully we'll get them here on this episode. So without further delay, what are we going to break into? Well, the pristine hockey surprise bag right there. Can we get something good? Well, that could bring some retro content and maybe some fireworks. We also have these right here, the Hobby Pack 2021 Upper Deck Series 2. We all know who's in that one there. 21-22 Series 2 Hockey, still on the chase for a couple of Detroit Red Wing Young Guns. We've got the, for 519 Canadian, 22-23 Upper Deck Series 2 Hockey. Let's try to get a Holloway rookie card there. 23-24 Upper Deck Series 1. Can we get that pretty cool Easter egg of Connor Bedard? And speaking of... We're still on the chase for a Connor Bedard Young Gun. Can we get one of those in there? That is going to be your lineup. So we're going to put those off to the side and we're going to open up the pristine right away. And I just need to get the trusty scissors out so I can open up this pack here. Can we get something good? Who knows? Well, we all know we can get some pretty cool retro hockey cards from there as mentioned and we also got okay so that one has been flattened that'll go off to the side we have 100 card sleeves right there that'll always be appreciated and come in handy right there pretty cool that'll go off to the side and i need to bring those that trusty pair of scissors out again to clip open these packs right there okay so we are getting warmed up and i'm slightly off center because this is a new makeshift area for the hockey card breaks but we got rookie pack and we've got a 2010 to current so why don't we open up the 2010 to current and see what we can get from there we have a kyle Logposo artifacts that one's a pretty solid looking card jordan greenway and we've got a Petrangelo right there. So three cards in that pack. That's pretty cool. Artifacts, pretty cool design. Some people love that. Some people don't. I personally don't collect that too much because it's a great design for the base set, but the hits are few and far between, and I'm not a big fan of that. Here we are, rookie pack, three cards. Will Pristine bring a massive rookie card to us. We have Ted Donato right there. That would be the rookie card from Pro Set. We have also Michael Backlund and Martin Nuke. That one is pretty interesting. So a Hockey Canada 72. Been a while since I've seen any cards sort of commemorating the 72 series. But we'll bring it up really close. And for your viewing pleasure why don't you press pause and read that in your leisure as we normally say here on firebox break so hope everybody's doing well enjoying their summer break it started for me and been quite busy as of late that sort of was the reason why i've been low on content and and not putting out any product as of late because a busy work calendar schedule i just wanted to relax didn't want to do too much so here we are we're going to open up this one right there because nothing wrong with starting off with a massive pack there might be a massive payout here who knows do we have a young gun first of all i don't think so that might be one of the canvas cards but still, we might have an awesome player. So we've got a Bowie right there. Not David, but we've got a Burakovsky. We have a Anderson. We've got a Warren Fogel, who's now on the move to L.A. Darren Helm. We have a Sam Steele. Marky rookies of Alex Alex. And that one is just a basic of Heischer. So a... Alexander Alexeyev will be part of the recap, so that's pretty cool. Why don't we just move on with another pack? I'm just moving these off to the side. 
And of course, when I start recording, the phone has to ring, but here we are. Series 2, 21, 22. By phone, I mean the cell phone. All right, here we are. And we got a young gun card there, if not one of the two, maybe a regular old peachy, who knows, here we are. Colton Pareko, we've got a Brandon Tanf, we've got a Gabe Velarde, we have a Connor Clifton, checklist of Nikita Kucherov and Ovenchikin, Ovechkin, we got Suter there, we've got a Erickson Eck and Young Guns, of course, but it's Ivan Prosvitov, so that's pretty cool. Not one of the big names, 484, still chasing Lucas Raymond as well as Mort Sider in that set. But there's also Quinton Byfield and some other names. So not too bad, but we've got a young gun to carry on with the streak. Here we are for 519 Canadian. Can we get a pretty solid young gun from here? As mentioned, looking out for the Dylan Holloway young gun that would be pretty solid and superb but i don't think that is that might be one of those insert cards lundstrom we've got a carry price right there definitely retiring we've got dylan dubé we've got a noah hannafin we've got a anders lee evan bouchard with the bush bomb we've got a lekkonen and welcome to winnipeg so winnipeg there Welcome to Winnipeg, the Jets. All right, so that is a pretty cool insert card nonetheless, and we're just basically moving and shifting cards over for the recap. So far we've got three. I'm just putting these packs back into their cards, back into the packs. We've got two left. Can we hit some massive firepower in here? Now, I was on the chase for a... Vincent Dayarnay, but he's since moved on and signed elsewhere, so no need to play or collect players who've moved on, but nonetheless, we've got a Nick Dowd. He did well with the team. We've got Faxa, we've got Dylan Strom, we've got Kapanen, Tyson Berry, former Oiler, Owen Power, we've got a Anders Lee again from different series, Rupe Hints. Sidney Crosby, Sid the Kid, Glossy. We have a... That one is Bergren, Rookie Retrospective. We've got a Bushnevich, and that is all we're going to get from that pack. Jay Godinger, so no massive firepower from that one there. And as of note, other than Crosby, but we'll put Crosby, Glossy over here somewhere. Other than most of these uh, players... Or these packs I should mention that one comes from a gravity feed box at your local shoppers drug mart so it all boils down to this can we get a massive card we are still on the chase for a Connor Bedard young gun of course Calder trophy winner we got Fabro we've got a Grizzly we've got upside down we've got a Roslovic Daniel Sprung upside down here. We've got a Josh Bailey there. We have Ferraro. A checklist of Wyatt Johnston and Kuzmenko right there. We have Thatcher Demko. And we're getting to the big cards. Marcus Valino. We've got Jackson Lacombe. Matthew Nyes and... Hey, Tyler Toffoli, so boo, there's no massive card other than the rookie card here of Matthew Nice, but we did not get any major fireworks. Wow, that, that's sort of shocking by some extent, and not what we're looking for, but as most of you are aware, when it comes to opening cards, you win some, you lose some, and this one was sort of a... I'd say underwhelming result. But here we are for the recap. If you're just joining on, Bushnevich, we've got a Berger in there. Alex, Alex, Marky rookies, welcome to Winnipeg on that one there. Lacombe, Toffoli, Matthew Nice, 
Ross B. N. The hit of the break, Prosvitov with the Young Guns. As mentioned, so we didn't really have a massive firepower pack, nor was the selection that great, but hey, I just wanted to welcome back all the viewers here to Firebox Breaks and let you know what was up. Busy summer starting and a lot of rest and relaxation in between on the weekdays, but it's good to be back and also we will comment on all things Stanley Cup final eventually, but at this point, I'm just going to leave it there and sort of calm down. But here we are. I hope you enjoyed the pack lineup and the results, and you let me know what you thought as usual in the comments down below. So we'll leave it there, and we'll try to get some more recent product like Upper Deck Extended Series and some other goodies like maybe Synergy or possibly Trilogy. But Regardless, we're going to leave it there, and I look forward to the next video and chatting with you as well. So, as mentioned, like, comment, and subscribe for all the good stuff. And as always, I'll be back with more content in the near future. Till then, bye for now.